Ladies and gentlemen, I welcome you to a new chapter in the life of Samuel Raj, a hardcore gamer who seems to be running out of time. Okay, he sure seems to be happy with himself. Maybe a bit too much though. Today is his first day at DSK Open for me. Let's see if he can make some new friends. Ah, an opportunity. What? Acting too smart, eh? Can't even shake a hand. Hello. Hey. Hi, Steve. Hi, Mr. Oh, I'm gaming. Uh, Amon, oh, please see you later. Sure. Okay. Oops. Sure doesn't feel good being ignored, eh? Hey, you know that these game guys don't have any work to do. Yeah, I always see them roaming around. I guess they don't have as much work as we as you guys have. Yeah, I even see them might be they play game all the day. Nothing else they have to do. Yeah, even the even while lunch time when I see they just go around and play with something. Yeah, they... Always discussing about games. And we're off to the first day of video game design with a mind full of doubt. Questioning his actions, sir. He really shouldn't have had met me to the other. Oh, he realizes his mistake. He better not take it in for granted, considering how he has acted up to now. This is it. His first day. All right. Good morning, students. My name is Professor Bla, and I'm going to be teaching you introduction to game design. So the first thing that you need to know about game design is game design is different from gaming. As a game designer, you'll be designing games, not playing games. There'll be somebody else who'll be playing your game. So you have to make it fun for the gamer. He's a game designer. All right. Now we have a few things in game designing. Uh, one of the main components of game designing is game analyzing. So you look at other games and you analyze them, you break them into smaller segments and you analyze their different components like you have the we have formal elements of the game and we have dramatic elements of the game. The formal elements comprise of the rules and the premise of the game. The drama elements comprise of other themes like the story or the character and the stuff. Now, who all is a hardcore gamer? Yeah, you, my friend, need to change your attitude towards life. You cannot be a hardcore gamer if you're a game designer. And work begins. Samuel realizes that in game design. It is never as easy as it looks, and that to achieve success in his work, he must put a lot of hard work towards his goal.
I played your game. Oh, you liked it? Yeah, it's very nice. Keep it up. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Thus ends this chapter of the life of Samuel Raj, a man who not only brought a change in himself and his perspective of game design, but also those of others around him. Oh, I can't.